Hello, Pat Minner here. Been putting together a what they call a bug out bag. Actually, several bug out bags. One is a long duffel to put uh, some of my weapons that I have uh, AK 47, uh, about six 30 round clips, of course, uh, probably 500 rounds of ammo to go with that, 12 gauge shotgun, 50 round bandolero loaded with slugs and buckshot and also uh, seven and a half for hunting. Uh, maybe you needed to kill something to eat, bird, fowl, squirrels, something like that. And then, you know, you've got your knives, uh, flashlights and batteries, uh, power bars, uh, something to sustain you till you can get somewhere where you can get isolated enough uh, to fire off a few rounds or whatever to take you some game or something like that. Uh, that's the gun part of the weapons. I've also built a uh, what I call a zombie killer tomahawk, 22 inch uh, tomahawk that's heavy and very sharp. That's something that I'd be carrying too. And I'll be carrying some throwing knives and some regular throwing tomahawks, a few of those. But also I'm going to be taking this old cold steel war hammer with me. This is a very devastating weapon. It goes back centuries, this design. Uh, the hammer part, self-explanatory for, you know, inflicting a lot of uh, blunt force trauma. Also, it's got the spike, and that's pretty self-explanatory uh, too. This thing, uh, uh, it's pretty heavy, so uh, could could do a lot of damage. It's an end time weapon. Uh, you could say zombie if you wanted to. It would certainly be a very devastating tool to have for stopping zombies. I haven't done a lot of maintenance on this thing, and so it's a little rustic. But uh, I like to throw this thing also, so I'd like to demonstrate uh, the very, very uh, penetrating uh, power of this spike on the back of this thing. The weight of this hammerhead just really drives it in. You could destroy a good block in no time at all by throwing this thing. So let me see if I can hit a target for you. Do this one here. Alright. We'll walk up there and check that out. You could shorten the handle on that thing and it'd throw easier. But, you know, it wouldn't have... Uh, it'd be pretty heavy to try to throw one-handed. I like to throw it two-handed. And you can see that spike. It is in there. You literally got to twist this thing out to get it out of there. So, the cold steel war hammer. End of time weapon. I would carry it with me I guarantee you uh, you could take down quite a few foes at one time with this thing so that's my little video for today end of time weapon okay y'all have a great day thank you